Hi everybody, today is going to be a bit of a short vlog. Um, are you eating your dinner? Uh, as you can see, Roman is not here, even though it's Saturday and he does not have school, but um, some friends of ours needed a ride to the hospital and uh, Roman is Roman is there now. Um, uh, there's just a lot going on in my mind, and um, I don't want to go into details. It's not my business to tell, um, but it's just been a very stressful day for um, some very good friends of ours, and um, we've just been trying to help out their their family as much as possible, and um, just trying to be there and comfort and um, entertain their son and just be there uh, just do what friends do and um, I'm almost I'm speechless I just don't I don't know what to say um, so like I said I don't want to go into too many details um, mainly it's just it's not it's not my business to talk about We've just gotten some relatively hard news about um, some little kids in our lives and kids in, within our circle and it's just been one of those days where you just hug your baby and hug your child and thank God that um, that they're happy and healthy and I've just been doing a lot of snuggling with Callum today and uh, like I said Roman Roman drove our friends to the hospital and He's still there, but um, yeah, it's just been that kind of day today. Tomorrow will be better. I know tomorrow will be better. We're going to the airport for a really fun children's festival, and I think that's exactly what the three of us will need, and I'm very excited to get to do something fun like that with Callum and, of course, with Roman as well. We've been so busy today. A homemade dinner was just not going to happen so um, we picked up some little pizza bite kinds of things from Aldi and Callum's eating that tonight for dinner so he's having a fun dinner tonight hmm mmm pizza bites mmm yummy we're having a really hard time keeping him in his high chair right now he just doesn't seem to want to sit in his high chair, so I figure I'm not going to deal with it right now. He's pretty good in public about eating in his high chair, but just home he just wants to play with his toys and everything's way more exciting and I just don't really feel like fighting him about it. I don't know, maybe I'm a bad mom, but it's just... I think a really good word of advice that I was given was um, when you enter the toddler years, pick your battles. And this is one I'm just going to let go for right now. As long as he sits nicely um, when we're out in public, then I don't care right now. I just don't. <laughs> Papa's home. Mm -hmm. Papa's home from the hospital. Uh oh. Are you wearing Papa's watch? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> okay. Goodness. You gonna go make some more mess? Are you not sleepy? What is that? That's the, uh, he always breaks the wheel. Yeah. Breaks the wheel? He's getting it stuck. Oh. I like that he always hands you a car and then he lays down to watch it with you. Yeah. <laughs> That's always in my ear. Pimple? Yeah. Those are the worst. How can you get pimples in your ear? Thank you. What'd you say? Why do you get pimples in your ear? What purpose do they do? I don't know. I had one in my other ear. Uh-huh. 
I'm not gonna do this. You're, you always get strange pimples though. You're I, always, huh? I know. So strange. You tired? Yeah. I think we're all tired except for that one. Um, Callum was so tired and he was all ready to go to bed and then Roman got home from the hospital and as soon as Roman got home, Callum just perked right up like, oh, here's my second wind. So I'm sure he's tired, but you just have to wait until he's ready to go to bed. Otherwise, he doesn't go to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.